description below. And finally, number 10, minimize tool changes. Now, one of the great advantages about the road device is that if it's programmed right, instead of changing a tool for each part, you change a tool after every 360 degree rotation of parts. For example, on op one of our demo dice parts, we faced all four parts, then changed tools and grab an end mill. Then we machine the sides of all four parts, change tools again and grab a drill and so on. So by minimizing tool changes, you'll cut the waste associated with tool change time by 75%. Now don't go too crazy. If there's a tool that you're using on the top and then later on the sides of the part, it's best to change back to that tool after all of the top operations have been completed. Okay, of course I'm gonna give you a bonus tip. When you're changing parts, you don't need to rotate it four times. Only rotate it twice. Change the top and the front facing part and then rotate it 180 degrees and do the same top and front part change. Now it's actually pretty simple. Just add these two lines of code right above your M30. 